Yes. And so I've been yeah. writing 1,500 words a day. And um, today I wrote 3,000 words this morning. So I'm making up for Friday, which I know I won't have time to write, write anything on Friday if I'm going to play some games and stream. So. What was the novel about? Uh, so it's a sequel. It's a spinoff of my, uh, of my first book, which is a, it's a kind of a fantasy novel with uh, LGBT themes. And so, uh, yeah, I'm determined. <laughs> Rod, hey Rod. Uh, can latex Rod too, right? I don't think you got any latex, right? right? Latex. Um, <laughs> you participate in NaNoWriMo? Yeah, this is my second time doing this, like trying to like write something in the month of November. Um, I did it four years ago and then I finally published that book in January this year. Yeah, DMAC, if you wouldn't mind uh, taking over on latex, that'd be great. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so this is my second time doing it, but this time I actually have, I feel like I have more of a plan. And so I'm going to be, yeah, my, my plan was 50,000 words. Now my last book was only 8,000 words total. It's a very small book. So, um, oh yeah, Rod, you, you mentioned this. You said your wife, um, yeah, okay. That's right. We, we, we did have this conversation at one point. I forgot. Um, yeah, it's really easy to self-publish with Kindle. I did it in January. Um, I also tried it with Barnes & Noble, Google Books, and iBooks on Apple as well. Um, but then I ended up taking all those down because I didn't really see much happen with it. And then plus, if you do it exclusively on Kindle, like it can be part of their offering. And so people who have, a, uh, have an unlimited Kindle agreement, they can actually... Um, get your book for free you know and so it's just it's gonna get in front of more people that way so and then I actually turned around and helped my brother publish his book of scary stories um, at, with with his art he did the cover art for my book uh, since I'm talking about it all. so yeah that's the book I published in January and so I'm writing a sequel slash spin-off based on one of the characters that's in it not the main character and uh, yeah, I'm excited. Uh, like I said, I've got 6,000 words written already on day three, so I'm feeling pretty accomplished, especially knowing that my first book was only 8,000 words, so. And I have like a full outline like planned, I'm like on a roll, I'm trying not to overdo it, and so that's why I'm still taking time to like stream and like live my life. I have a very specific opponent in mind for the final round of this So yeah, Rod, definitely like you know let her know like it's really easy to publish on kindle the hardest part is just setting up the text in the right format for the kindle import but they have some of the tools that you download that'll help 